Well, hello there. How are you t this fine day? I bet going back to work was a bit of a bind, wasn't it, after the bank holiday weekend? Yeah, my Sarah had to work Friday, she had to work Sunday and Monday. Uh, so, but she did get, must admit, she did get a rather nice day off on Saturday. Uh, we didn't do a lot, but just lazed around the house. But today, on a Tuesday, it's been absolutely glorious outside. Bit cloudy sometimes, it's gone cloudy now. But it's a good chance to uh, experiment with my HDR camera. The uh, GoPro, in the last update from the GoPro 12, has had the, the HDR feature. Didn't know that until uh, I looked at the update uh, yesterday. Uh, so I've given this a try. I was trying my other camera out with a neutral density lens. Um, but it got the the background was rather underexposed and the foreground was rather overexposed. So I'm going to try the the HDR. Uh, just put put in a comment what camera you p prefer to use as as a small vlogging camera or action camera. Uh, I find that the Pocket Three is not really an a action camera, but the uh, GoPro is. So we'll we'll. Uh, We'll look forward to getting some uh, HDR video when I'm out and about on the bike. We'll see what happens uh, when the weather's a bit nicer, when it's guaranteed not to rain. But uh, as I looked at the forecast this morning, it said rain, but it's, we haven't had any yet. So that's a good thing. Um, I don't know about you guys, but I do love sitting in the garden. I spend most of the, uh, most of the morning out here with a couple of cups of coffee and uh, just watch the world go by. Not that I can see much from here anyway. Well, I see the clouds go by and I watch the birds and uh, like I say, we've got two robins that come into the garden. They're coming right up to the back door now. Um, and uh, hopefully, hopefully, if, if I am patient enough, I can get them to feed out my hands. That would be really nice if we could do that. Uh, yeah, so yeah, a pair of robins. We get, there's a, a couple of blue tits that fly over. Of course, they won't come in the garden now because of the robins. And uh, we get to, the old starling, of course, the starling will get chased off too, but they're so much bigger than the, the robin. Uh, and we get to tiny pied wagtails as well as wrens. So we do get smaller birds in, but so at the moment the, uh, the garden's being dominated by the robin. So that's right, rather nice. Uh, yeah, I do like wildlife. And of course, we've got a lavender tree during the summer months, which should put out lots of lovely lavender flowers. And of course, we'll get loads of bees. Um, I do like bees, oh, quite cute animals aren't they? But some people do all this don't they? They do this with their arms and <laughs> they're the ones that get stung. The people that are calm and serene and just say go away fly, uh, they just clear off don't they? Um, but yeah I don't know what you found. But yeah I've been spending all morning, I've been fixing up the water features so I've got, um, I've repositioned them away from the, the patio area that we are now just simply so that we can just hear the gentle trickle of water. Uh, it is quite relaxing, isn't it? Hearing it. It's like living next to a stream. So of course, I often sit, to, last summer I certainly sat and listened to the, the water trickling. Um, very relaxing, in my opinion. Of course, you might not find that relaxing at all. You might find it absolutely terrible and not like it at all. But yeah, it's unfortunately, the sun's gone in today. Yeah, this after, well, this afternoon it has. The lunchtime when I was out, the sun was out, very bright, uh, very bright. So I might have to dig out my sunglasses. So let us know how you're getting on. Let us know if you do use a camera and what camera you do use. And uh, we'll see what we can do about putting a video out. OK, that's it. I've rambled on for four minutes. So thank you very much. I'll see you later. Bye then.